I'm going to show you a very neat trick on how you can cut around fuzzy hair. Assuming that the color of the hair is different to the background, um, the background could be yellow, could be pink, could be green, could be whatever. Um, even if it's a couple of different colors, you can run this twice to, to do every color, which you will see. Now, this is a good example because you have a light background versus a dark hair. If you had a if you had blonde hair and you had you know a blue sky, you could still do it very very easily. Let me show you. So um, there's a trick that GIMP has that Photoshop doesn't. This is one of the beautiful things about GIMP. Color to alpha, layers, transparency, color to alpha. You can change any color to be transparent. And what we're going to do is make the white background transparent. So, you know, I can just grab that color, that shade, and say, okay, make that transparent. So this selects the individual pixels, right? And then this one sets a um, more of a soft transparency threshold to that. So you can see what that's doing. That's getting rid of the face. So the trick is, uh, obviously it's going to get a little bit of white areas like the white of the eye. The trick is to do this. Um, cut first, soft cut, very soft cut, and a rough cut. Doesn't have to be, it won't, doesn't, it's not time consuming at all. But what you can do is say, all right, I'm going to cut around here where the white parts are, right? So I'm going to cut all around there. There's all the white parts selected. So I'm not touching the face, yeah? And that's the, that's really the, tr the trick to this. Then do the same thing. Layer, transparency, color to alpha. Um, let's remove this for a sec and let's actually select that color. So put the um, transparency threshold up, then put the opacity threshold up. Um, there you go. Done. Now there's a little bit of dark gray left here, over here. We can get rid of that just by uh, rubbing it out. Now, if I get a different background such as this one and paste it over here, um, put that at the back, you can see the cut is quite good. Now, imagine you were doing that with the lasso tool. It would have taken you an eternity. So this is a trick I use, um, and it saves me a hell of a lot of time. I hope it has saved you a lot of time. It's a bloody great trick. And it's one of the best features of GIMP, the fact that you can um, color to alpha and it's quite variable and adjustable. Thanks for watching. I hope that helps you.